So I'm here with, uh, well, please introduce yourself. Yeah, my name is Florence Wajiko uh, from Woman of Worth. Yeah. Uh, in short, wow, Woman of, of Worth is, an, is a community-based organization in a slum in Nairobi, outskirts, not very far from the town, mm -hmm. where we work with women and children. Uh, in women, we work with the women that are in drug addiction, that are alcoholics and uh, prostitution from ages of uh, 10 to 40, 50 there, because they are all affected. And uh, we just try, basically what we do is we try to empower them so, uh, socially and economically so that they can rise up or, or rise up and take their rightful position in the society. For a woman, is a very essential part of the society. So uh, we try to help them come out of the drug addictions and, and uh, empower them economically so that they can take their position in the society while still working with the children. The children will basically... Uh, fight for their rights mm. in trying to provide for them basic needs like food, shelter and, uh, and education. Currently the, we have a project on the ground, a, 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 a daycare services, where we take in children that are left by their parents when they go for casual labor, they lock the children in the house because they can't afford house help, so they lock them in the house from morning to evening. Yeah. So we are just trying to mobilize them into bringing the children to the daycare because they can't afford house help. So they bring them in the morning and they pick them in the evening. And also, we, we, they are also those ones that, are, that their mothers are alcoholics. We, we take them in because they are, most of them are malnourished, they are not yeah. fed well, so we take them in and feed them as we are empowering their parents. So entirely that, we do, that is what we do with the children. We also uh, offer sponsorships because there are so many children that have never gone to the school. They, yeah. are, they, are, they are above age. We sponsor them to the nearby schools. And we also uh, feed their families, the ones that are not able to be fed. They, they can't afford a meal. Mm. We feed them also. Well, you guys are doing very great work. Yeah. Uh, you were the case studies at the 1% event here in Nairobi. Yes. Uh, Obviously, yesterday you got a chance to explain a little bit about uh, what the case study is about. Mm -hmm. uh, what are you expecting out of today? Uh, I'm expecting to come up to learn so many things because, of course, these are guys who have different skills and many skills. And my expectation today is when I'm coming out of this because, one, I have, uh, I'm not able to promote my, my, my project uh, in the social media. So I, I want to come out of this place knowing how to promote the project. Mm -hmm. Uh, and how to raise on how to raise funds on how to work on Twitter blog and all those things so I'm, I'm, I'm not able to do that so I'm expecting to come out of knowing all those things I, I'm not on tweet I'm not on blog <laughs> so, <laughs> so, so, so the first thing we need a, a Twitter account is not number that, one that is the first thing that we need <laughs> <laughs> and blog how to promote entirely and also to get partnerships and, and I'm, I'm also believing that after this thing it will not be end of everything we'll still uh, develop relationships with this Guys, it's so just the beginning. Me, yeah, it's just the beginning. Yeah. And, and so far, it was only yesterday for a few hours, and I've learned a lot. Yeah. I've learned a lot. Okay, and, and we still have a whole day to go. Yeah, so, uh, so I know I've learned a lot. Yeah. I, okay, I well, thank you so much for this. Yeah. And, uh, well, enjoy your day. Thank you.